Hey guys, JP here. I hope you're well and that you're having an amazing start to 2014. I'm going to send you a very quick video to give you five things to do to make sure that you have the most awesome, happiest, healthiest year. And the first one is, okay, obviously it's all health and fitness related and it's all got to do with peak performance and physical and uh, psychological peak performance. The first one is move your body. Okay, you have to, have to, have to move your body. One of the three things we're designed to do as human beings are eat, move, and sleep. And most of us don't move today, so move your body. And here's an easy rule of thumb. Move your body 30 minutes every day. I call it firing up the furnace. Firing up the furnace is just sweating a little bit. So do something every day for 30 minutes that you sweat. Then you know every day you can go to bed happy knowing that you've moved your body as the way it is designed to move in life. The second thing is, is to eat natural, healthy, nutritious foods. Get rid of the junk food, get rid of the white powdery, sugary foods, and eat everything that is natural. If you use a scale from A to F, A being natural, try to stick to all your, try to stick to foods that are as close to A as possible. So natural vegetables, proteins, fish, um, lots of, you know, green leaves. Uh, nuts and seeds, anything that would be available to a caveman or a cave woman, or which is otherwise known as the Paleolithic or the Paleo diet. For me, that's the best diet. I've used it for years. I've used it with my clients, and it's very, very, very effective. It's very easy to follow, and it's very natural and healthy. The third thing is is to supplement your diet with um, um, with vitamins and minerals. Because, unfortunately, you can't get all the vitamins and minerals from your food today. Because of our modern lifestyles, because of, un unless you're eating everything organic and good organic food, because there's different types of organic food and different, uh, I guess, classes of what makes something organic. But top up your um, nutrition with supplements. So like fish or omega-3s, omega uh, vitamin D. I take omega-3s, vitamin D, magnesium, zinc. And a very good multivitamin or multivitamin, depending on where you're from in the world. The fourth one is to sleep. You need to make sure that you sleep. Once again, I said the three things that you need to do as a human being are eat, sleep, move. So you need to sleep. Sleep is when you recover. Sleep is when you reshape, refresh, and rejuvenate your body and mind. And if you're not sleeping, you're going to be stressed. And if you wake up stressed in the morning, that's not a way you want to start your day because then that's going to affect your diet, your mood, your energy, everything. And then the fifth thing is be present. Be happy with yesterday. Be happy with what's coming tomorrow. But don't live in the past and don't live in the future. Be present with where you are. Be still. Try practicing things like yoga or meditation to just take your, your mind down a notch and to think less. You know, Deepak Chopra has a saying, we're human beings, not human thinkings or human doings. I absolutely love that saying. Try to be more yourself. Try to be happier with who you are right now and not focusing on the future so much and not focusing on what you've done wrong in the past or the mistakes you've made. Because first of all, and first, you know, very important, mistakes are lessons learned. Don't think of them as mistakes. I believe that anyone that hasn't made a mistake, they haven't learned any lessons in life. So yeah, mistakes were good in the past, the future will come, but be happy with where you are now. You know, my main thing, my main mission in life, and all my main, the thing that makes me, what drives me in life is health and happiness. And my definition of happiness is being okay with where you are, being happy with where you are going in your future, but also being happy with where you are right now. So those are five things that you can do, five things that you can use or tools that you can use to help you have a happier, healthier, more gangster 2014. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I will see you next week for the next one. Take care. Peace.